I thought I'd do a video on the difference between the two types of butane gas you can easily get. So obviously butane gas is used for refilling butane lighters, uh, so that's simple enough. But there's generally two variants of it, and it can be important that you know the difference between the two variants. That's what I want to go into this video. So the standard type of butane most people get is this. It doesn't really matter on the brand, but it's just normally used, says something like universal lighter refill, universal gas lighter refill. Um, now, it might say stuff like ultra-refined uh, for maximum care and performance, but they generally aren't. This is the thing you have to be careful with. Is It's one of those things where a brand can say, you know, this is super refined, but unless they've got certain keywords in there, it doesn't mean much. Um, so, this is a cheap kind of butane. This is the kind you'd put in most of your clipper lighters, anything that's got refillable butane in, but not jet lighters. So, this is what I want to get onto. So, both of them are butane, both burn the same. The difference is the more refined type, which I'll show you in a moment, is basically is extra filtered or something like that. So what that means is that when you use the butane in the lighter, it's less likely to clog up and leave deposits in the lighter. So for a cheap lighter with a normal flame, you want the cheap butane. The reason being it's much cheaper to buy this in bulk, so it's cheaper to refill your lighter, which is ideally what you need. Uh, you don't have to worry about normal lighters clogging up because the holes and things on the lighter, the gas ports are quite big. When you have jet lighters, they have much smaller holes and that causes a problem because gunge that builds up will block the lighter faster. So obviously butane being a gas, it's kind of still like an oily deposit type thing and that's where the cheaper butane leaves more. So, so as said, this is the cheapo butane you get, use this for the majority of your lighters. Now, Newport's a good brand of it, but there are a couple of others. But this is where they put extra purified and things like that. Um, and see where it says, for thermal butane powered lighters and things like that. Um, what that's saying there, basically, is that this is a refined butane. Um, so, what they've got on here is just kind of a guide to different lighters. But what this is for is for the jet lighters where they have the smaller holes that let fuel fuel, fuel through essentially. Um, and those are prone to clogging. So if you wanted to compare it to a firearm, this is shooting a cheap surplus corrosive ammo through it. This is shooting sort of really high grade uh, ammunition through it. If you're doing it for a really cheap gun, you obviously use a cheap ammo, you don't care, you just clean it every now and then if you need to. Um, if you're doing it with a really expensive high performance thing, you want the high performance stuff in it. So the problem is this costs a lot more. Um, I think when I've looked before, I can't remember the exact price off the top of my head, but something like this, despite being a bigger size, the cheap butane, still is like you could buy two cans of this for one can of this, or sometimes even like two and a half to three cans of this for one can of this. Both the types you can find on Amazon and eBay normally. Um, but as I said, most of my lighters I refill with this. If I have the really uh, cheap sort of uh, jet fuel lighters, like the Tor Jets, where for a pound or two you can buy like a pack of five, I use this because I use a logic that once they gunge up, I'll throw them away anyway. Um, but if I'm using a nice jet lighter, I obviously use this thing because I don't want it to gunge up and become worthless. So there you go. That's the difference between the two types of butane. Um, I said, as I said, this is for your jet lighters, ideally, if they're good jet lighters. This is for your bulk standard lighters. Um, both have the same kind of nozzles for refilling it, but obviously make sure you choose the right gas for your lighter, because you don't want to gunge up and make an expensive jet lighter useless. Um, it's better just to pay a bit more and use this stuff. And you also don't want to waste your money by using this stuff in a cheap lighter. You just want to use this stuff, because if they both work the same in a cheap lighter, why do you want to actually, you know, cost more for a refill.